King News, my wonderful people, the same message is just going round and round and you cannot begin to imagine what exactly is going on. We are talking about Lagos, okay? Lagos 2023, our very own brother Olajide has sent a message to Babajide Sanwolu, prepare your hand over note, you are next. What happened in Oshun is a tip of the iceberg. You are next and you are going to to be you're going to be a one one tenor governor just one tenor and this is what is happening right now you're just going to have one tenor yourself and emo state governor both of you get ready you are coming down you are next and this is what you know is happening and why every one of us must do that which is absolutely necessary to bring you know this to an end right now so this is what is happening my wonderful people uh olajide who is the uh, pdp a pdp Governorship candidates in Lagos State is saying the reign of Tinubu's godfatherism in you know in uh, in uh, Lagos State is coming to an end. Just as you can see, his very hometown Oshun State, you can see what has happened. They rejected him and his brother Olajide said, uh, "My brother, you got a nod from Tinubu that you can go ahead, right? Hmm. Get ready. We will get a reply from the people of Lagos State that it's all over. Well, let's get all the details. It's about time. Lagos 2023. Start preparing your handover note. You are next. Olajide tells Sanwolu, Tinubu's hold on Lagos." His godfatherism days are over. The Lagos People Democratic Party governorship aspirant Olajide Adeniro, popularly known as Jado, has advised the Lagos State Governor Babajide Sanwolu to start preparing his handover notes because he will be defeat he will be defeated in 2023 governorship election. In a statement signed and released to released by his media aid, aid Benga, the governorship aspirant congratulated the people of Oshun and most importantly, Senator Adeleke on winning the governorship election in the state. Tells Sanwolu, Tinubu's hold on Lagos as godfather, the days are over. Get ready. He may have given you the nod that you should contest and um, he will allow you to become. But it is beyond him now because Lagosians will be the ones to decide the fate. Did you see what Adeleke pulled? 403, 371 from the 30 local government area where he won 17. Why your, your brother, nephew, scored 373, 27. Reacting to the victory, Mr. Deniron said the victory is a testimony that the era of the godfatherism and those who meddle into leadership is over. And San Wulu is a product of that. Prepare your handover notes because those days are coming to an end. We will send you we will send you a message to say we told you. Get ready. He said Oshun mirrors the hard ship that the people of Lagos has gone through for the last four years. He finally advised Sam Wolu to start finishing touch to his handover note and because the days are drawing closer and around the corner when he will hand over really soon. So this is what is happening. They are saying to him, you see your godfather who has given you a nod, he told you, yes, son, you can go ahead. Uh, we are right behind you. He said, well, Lagosians are going to prove to you that they, they are the ones who decide. And the new electoral system is proving to everyone that um, you can't just come in and begin to have your way. You can't just come in and begin to inf you know, infringe on people's rights and just you know, take things as though you are the one who has the final say. Nobody. You know, what has happened in Oshun State is a clear message. A clear message that this is what it is and that um, nobody, nobody should, you know, undermine or pretend that, you know, what is currently on ground is not happening. In fact, it's clear indications that there are open, things are opening up. Okay, the people are beginning to see and light has been shine, light has been shown on dark areas and um, or shown state are clear, is clear indication that those things that they normally do and get away with it is no longer business as, as usual. Demola Deleke, 
you know, became the winner uh, against all her odds. He, he, he scored and um, he, he succeeded. And today you can say, uh, you know, it's a different ball game altogether. And so uh, Vajide Sangwo is, is being advised by the People Democratic Party presidential candidates to get to prepare his handover notes. Uh, Sanwolu is of the All Progressive Congress. Why um, Jado is of the People Democratic Party, who has chosen Atres uh, to be, uh, you know, Funke to be his running mate. Well, we will wait and see. The days are becoming clearer, and um, elections and things that are happening are clear indications that you know the people are beginning to make their choice yeah you're beginning to make their choice for a long time timu has had a strong and a, you know a strong hold on those who become leaders in certain parts especially the southwest region of the country well guess what all that is broke is is beginning to break off gradually and um you know uh, those things he used to do are becoming a thing of the past uh, because it is a new dawn, is a dawn of a new day, and a new day is breaking upon the nation. Realization on truth is becoming the order of the day. Well, my wonderful people, it is happening, and uh, Majid Sanwolu is being advised to uh, get ready. You know, you know, you know politics now. Everybody's getting on the other person. You know, when they see on the street, they are best of friends. So, so don't let them distract you. They know how they roll. Okay, they know how to roll. It, it is what it is. Okay, please don't forget to give us a thumbs up, like us, share, subscribe. Remember that Nigerians we will be the ones to decide moving forward how things turn out and will not allow certain individuals to be the judge of that. Okay, the days are here where every one of us must rise up to the occasion and ensure that, you know, we, we decide the right future for this nation by making and taking the right choices and not just allowing or allowing just certain individuals who have no true heart or intention for this nation to be better, to be the determinant of what happened going forward. Well, this is what is happening and why every one of us must rise up and, you know, get our PVCs so that you can make a statement by, the, by casting of your vote. Yes, we can all together make that statement. It is what it is. It is what it is. It is. So, my wonderful people, right now is about time we all, with one accord, yes, get our PVCs, vote out bad governance, and vote in good ones. Okay? Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up, like us, share, subscribe. God bless. Have a fantastic and a lovely day from us. It's bye for now.